Hello, my name is Laura Madeira. As an accounting professional, I use QuickBooks Accountant 2012 when working with my clients' files. In this segment, you will be introduced to working with the file manager exclusively available with QuickBooks Accountant and improved in 2012. With the file manager, we can automatically open the QuickBooks file with the correct version, organize and sort our clients' files, store our user login and password, and batch upgrade multiple client files at once. Let me show you how you can work easier with your clients' files using QuickBooks Accountant 2012 File Manager. File Manager installs automatically with your QuickBooks Accountant installation. You can access it from the icon on the icon bar or also from an open QuickBooks file from the Accountant's menu. On the overview, read information about version control, password storage, the simple steps to using File Manager, and even see it in action with a short video. I'm going to click on Launch QuickBooks File Manager. There are three simple ways to add client files and shortcuts to their files in the File Manager. Any of these methods will not in any way disrupt the way that you normally store your client's files. I can click on the wizard, I can drag and drop from Windows Explorer, or I can go find a single file or type a client's file name and import the information quickly into QuickBooks File Manager. I am going to select the first option. If you use a folder with multiple QuickBooks client files, you may choose from QuickBooks file names. I am going to select from client folders. I have stored my client files in individually company named folders as you see represented here. Next, I need to browse to where I have stored those client folders. Once I click OK, the files will then be brought into my file manager. From this window, I can then remove from a list any of the files that are selected if I desired. I'm going to select Finish. The client list is now updating to include those files from my QuickBooks folders. These files listed here represent individual folders. For example, if I click on this company folder, you will see that I have many different types of files. We'll talk about those in just a moment. So again, how can I get files into my QuickBooks File Manager? I can click on the Client drop-down and select the wizard. Use Windows Explorer to drag and drop or add them one at a time. Also from this menu, I can rename a client. I can merge client folders together. And if I have added a new client to Windows Explorer, I will want to come in here and click on Refresh. That way it will pull in that new data folder into my QuickBooks File Manager 2012. Removing folders is easy as well. If you no longer need that client folder in your File Manager, simply click on Remove Client. Rest assured that you are not doing anything to your normal storage on your hard drive. It was that easy to keep QuickBooks File Manager organized for working with your individual files. Additionally, in File Manager 2012, we have a new information tab. Once a client's file has been opened in File Manager, important information displays for the selected file. We also can group our client list and create our own custom groups. From the Groups drop-down, select Add Edit Groups and I have already created a payroll grouping. I want to select multiple files at one time, so I'm selecting the control key on my keyboard and then selecting the right arrow to place those different files into the group called payroll. Now I can filter my client list by any of my custom made groupings or those that are provided with File Manager. Or I could come in the search box and type criteria for searching for a client's file. Additionally, with the company selected on the left, I can see what type of files are in that company folder. I have company files, accountant's copy files, and backup and portable files. With the files selected, I can click on the Files menu, and I have actions that are specific to that particular file type. The Password Vault holds encrypted login information for your client's files. When you launch a QuickBooks file from within File Manager, the system will use the password vault information so that you don't have to enter it manually, helping you work more efficiently. You will be prompted only once per File Manager session for your vault password. 
you will need to create a username and a password, and it needs to be a complex password. If you are uncertain what that is, click on the link to learn more, and choose two challenge questions and indicate the answers. The password vault will then work this way. If a file has a single user and no password, it will launch through File Manager. If there are multiple users requiring passwords, and you have stored a password in the password vault. You can double click on a file here or right click and select open and it would bypass the menu requiring you to put in a username and a password. That will work for files version 2011 or newer. Next, let me talk about Batch Upgrade. With Batch Upgrade, QuickBooks will gather all of the QuickBooks files that need to be upgraded to the newest version. Simply place a check mark next to those files that you wish to upgrade and click on Upgrade Selected Files. If the file requires a password, it needs to be in the Vault password in order to complete the upgrade process. The upgrade process can take some time and you cannot use QuickBooks while it's going through that process. So you might want to do this in an evening hour or when you can walk away from your computer. After the upgrade is complete, a column will list the status of each of the individual upgrades. This way we do not need to upgrade a client's file singly one after another. We can do them in a batch format. From the Tools menu click on Options and you can determine what information displays on the panels. Or new for 2012, we can now create a file manager backup which stores our shortcuts and the information that we've grouped together as well as restore the file manager backup. This way if you are moving your data to a new computer you can take the work that you have done here in file manager and transfer it to the new computer. Also from the help menu you can click on help for help text, watch a video tutorial and learn more about file manager. Using file manager helps us work more efficiently with multiple client files. We no longer have to guess at which version we need to open in order to work with our client's file. Now we can see important information about our client's file and back up the file manager, all new and improved with QuickBooks File Manager 2012.